hey guys welcome back to another video and today guys i will be showing you guys on how to braid your own hair so i have been doing this for a while like literally for years and i are i already have my hair sectioned and i'm just gonna go ahead and show you guys how to braid your hair so stay tuned Every time. Okay now guys, so here are the three packs of braid that I'll be using and the three packs of braids are 1B, 27 and 2. And what I'm going to do here is I'm going to mix the hair. So I just speed up the video because it took me a while to, um, to mix it. Also, I have to separate the ear in half so i could grip it more because it was like loosening and everything so yeah so while you while you're mixing make sure that you comb out the ear so that it don't create knots okay and i'm just Mixing, combing, mixing, combing until I have the result that I wanted and this is how the hair is looking So it's very very cute. I love the turnout of my entire hair So as you guys see my hair is already sectioned up like pre-part and everything like that And I don't have a video included in this one But if you want to see how I pre-part my hair before I braid Then I'll be leaving the link in this video that you can go ahead and watch that video before this one To see how I section my hair and trust me guys pre-parting if you're doing your own hair I recommend you to do the pre-part first because this took me um, if it wasn't for work or you know house chores and everything I could have finished my hair in one day but because of all of that um, I finished my hair in four day right so it took me a while to finish my hair but my hair came out really really cute so um, I'll recommend you guys to prepare your hair first and then braid because it will it will be a lot easier for you guys to move faster and finish in time if you don't have anything doing so i'll recommend you guys to do this style this method okay so as you guys see i make sure that when i braid i'm going to give you um a close-up detail a close-up one um how i attach the braids but while i go along um the first thing i did is i give my natural hair a plat one plat first and then i add in braids I add in about three pieces and then I braid out until I feel like it's getting thin and I just add some more ear to cover up my natural ear and then I just keep keep braiding and then keep adding you can add the desired amount that you want okay so you don't have to be doing this thin amount like me I just want the thin look because it would be a little bit lighter for me and less braid will use then again at the end of the day my braid finish on me i am so happy that i have some leftovers of here that i could like attach to the front and so forth so um keep watching this video i don't want to talk too much in this one but i just want to make sure that you guys understand this video and i want to give you guys um um good explanation about the braiding and all these stuff because i don't want to be doing um a lot of video in like talking short and then you know make you guys watch this because i want to make sure that you guys are understanding um what i'm doing in my videos so i don't want i know a lot of you guys don't like the the bag of talking but um in this video i feel like i'm i feel like i'm supposed to talk so you guys can understand because come on we're in the summer and i know a lot of y'all want to spend less money in doing your hair knowing that you can do it yourself but you want to watch some videos to get um you know a nice and cute ear style for the summer or even for christmas because you know christmas is right around the corner so yeah and i have to keep my hair um maintained because i'm working and um i don't have time to like in my natural hair to put my natural hair up in a bun or anything like that so i want to protect this style for about two to three months and yeah i'm good 
so as you can see i'm just going along and speeding up the video as well guys speeding it up because i'm not ready as yet to show you guys a close-up on how i attach the braid so i'm just gonna go ahead and speed up this side and then i'll give you a view Okay guys so this is how far I have reached and my hair is looking so amazing um, this is what it meant to trust the process because my hair trust me when I started my hair I wonder if this color is going to look good on me but um, this color is really amazing so as you guys can see I zoom up the video because I will be showing you guys on the other side oh I attach the braids okay so my hair is looking cute like really cute okay i really 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 cute i'm just feeling if hair in a loose ear out so now i'm going to show you guys a close-up how i attach the braids so i'm just separating um the hair is here because i don't want it to attach to the hair that i will be doing so three braids will be going to this row right here to this section so i'm just you know add my oil my gel to the ear and then I'm just gonna go ahead and show you that I split my hair in three and I just add the first braid and then plait and then I'm going to add the second braid and then plait again and then I'm going to add my third braid so what I did is to braid my natural hair attach the first one braid attach the second one braid and attach the third one and then braid all the way down and as i said before guys if you reach to a point where your hair is feeling um thin and that your natural ear is peeking out then just go ahead and add more braids to the ear to hide it because that's what i did and trust me there's a reason behind it because after a week if you if you end up with your hair peeking out after a week i warn you that your hair is going to be old okay 
because you're gonna be wondering i did my hair a week ago and my hair is looking like this yes people that will be the reason okay as i said before in the beginning of this video i have been doing my hair for a while and you know when you're when you're a beginner you're trying something for the first time and you know it not looking the way you want it to look i go ahead and i try and i try i try because very listen to me I am very determined if I want something to get done I am going to get it done I'm gonna get it done good too okay so I'm very very determined so when I just started braiding my hair um, my hair was like you know looking old because I my hair was like peeking out and everything you know somebody would just have started for the first time but I know exactly what they're doing yes that is what I'm talking about and I try my hair over and over and over and over and it's been about four years now since I'm braiding my hair on my own and I've been doing people here too so just imagine so I'm so proud of myself that I reached this stage in life where I can do my own hair without spending a lot of money for people to do my hair and then again I am so afraid for the salon because when I do my hair I do my hair two time at the salon I think it's three time and I feel like my hair is to how they manage my hair I'm so afraid like my hair is really tender and everything um, I do my hair tight but not tight enough to kill me like my head tearing off no okay so my head tender when I do my hair at salons and also my hair I put in um, a lot of work in my hair and I know that when I pull this out when I pulled out the um, the braid that I did at the salons my hair looks shorter than the before when I just go there like I don't know my hair just pick off so um, the talent have been in my family because my mother is a uh, Hair stylist and a te nail tech and also my, my aunt can do here so I'm just gonna give a big shout out to two of them because I know that talent is from them so big up my auntie and big up my mother so this is how my hair is looking guys really amazing yeah and this is the length of my hair so far guys I have finished half of my head and it's now time to do the front and this is how my hair is looking and believe this was the second day yep it was the second day so guys this is day four yep day four so um I finished my hair um, on day 24 so yeah this is how my hair is looking guys it's not trim as yet and also it's not water as yet so what i'm going to show you is the final result like you know everything braided down already come on guys tell me if this one look good look at that sorry about the edges okay i don't know why my head front is like this but i'm gonna get the, um, a touch up cream so I can get my edges straight so I can make edges you know my baby hair so my hair is looking lovely guys look at that look at that So guys let me tell you something this year is really long like literally long i never know that my hair was this long until i um stand up because when i first started the video i was like braiding 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 i know i want a length but not this length you know but i'm gonna show you guys it's very very long let me just go out So what I'm going to do is I'm going to clip the ends. I, I feel like I want to curl the ends. I never like actually do my hair before and curl the ends. And second of all guys, as you can see, there is different ear here and right here. So what really happened is that 
the 27 hair finish on because it's one pack so if you know you want to do your hair and do it this small get yourself two packs okay because what i have remaining is um the the two and the one b so the 27 is finished like completely why i have one b and um, two ear remaining is because i have some leftovers so i just um add that to it because as you can see i have three packs of here which is the one b two and 27 so i just you know yeah i just use the leftovers and add it right here so that's why it's different but so far it's looking cute it's look like a you know a style like you know half and half and then the back is the same so <laughs> oh guys this year is really cute like i really spent time with the parting so guys i don't have a scissors to help with the trimming so what i'm gonna do is to do this thing off camera because I don't want YouTube to ban me so um what I'm going to do is that if you are Jamaican and you know this method I don't know if other country do it but you have a light and you just light burn the ends they they, they left out burn them off and then you have to water because I don't have a scissors I used to have one but what really happened with that scissors is that um the handle then just come off like right off so anyway Let's get right into the video of hot watering because I won't show you guys when I'm burning my hair off. <laughs> okay guys, so I am finally finished with my hair and I didn't get the chance to um, make a video of me hot watering my hair because the time is getting really really late and I have work in the morning so this is a final result guys and i make sure got the ends trim because my, as i said before in the video my hair was really really long so i get rid of it um give me a minute i'm gonna show you the amount that i took off so this is the amount that i took off the hair and i use a razor because i don't have a scissors so you can use a razor if you have one if not you can use a knife <laughs> okay guys so for the most i will be using the lota body and this is with coconut and shea oil so it has it has um a really good smell so you can go ahead and purchase this um let's try this out oh and you don't have to shake <laughs> Okay, so let's get that. Let me just shake it in case of anything. Let's see something. Alright, it just moves up in here, guys. And you just put that in your hair. That's not an answer. It's not good. But, so. give you the last lint check of this hairstyle so yeah <gasps> lint check lint check lint check lint check so I hope you guys enjoy this video if you do enjoy this video please give this video a like and remember to subscribe if you want to see more of my videos and leave a comment down below what you guys think about this hairstyle and let me know if you would like me to upload a video on how to style this medium length braid <laughs> okay so see you guys in my next um, upcoming videos bye Mwah.